Hello everybody, Trackmaster 2016 back then, and today we have the Trackmaster 2006 Rocky. Now it comes with Rocky, the crane, which is motorized, but it's not motorized as a roller long engine, it is motorized in this fashion. You can see these pistons here and this string, you see, turn it on here, you have to turn it on right there on the car. You see it move up and down, it picks up stuff has a magnet on the front here you can pick up stuff and tilt twirl it around and all that you can lay it down on the car well it's supposed to pick up this crate here so what you can do is you can pick up this crate put it on the side swing the hook pick up the crate loosen the crate a little bit and Pick up the crate, swing it around, and drop it down. And the crate is hollow on the inside. It's hollow. There's a magnet. There's a piece of metal there, so the magnet can pick up the crate. The thing is, the hard part about this is... I want to pick up a piece of wire that I didn't want to pick up. Come on. It's going to be kind of hard to uh, modify it with hook and chain couplers. Because I don't have any... It's the bottom of it. I don't have any wire. Another thing about this Rocky is these legs pop out. These legs here, these little here pop out. So it can be stabilized. It has four on each side. That's four, so you can have them there on stabilizers. As you can see right here, the car out of the way. As you can see right here, it stabilizes and he spins. Oh, he spins there. He doesn't spin 360, he just spins right there. So half and half. So 90 degrees, I think. Um, so, yeah, so you can close them up, hook up the crate car, and send them along your way if you have an engine. Okay. So for the mess here, it's supposed to be for the thumbnail of the video, but hey, we're going to be taking a look inside his battery compartment. So you oh, got to keep unscrewing little bits, and it takes one AAA battery, one AAA. But we're going to change the battery out. To a new fresh battery because I don't know how how long that's been in there. Um, I'll be right back in okay. a second. Okay, so we've got a fresh battery. We're going to pop it in. Gonna put the cover back on. Sorry for the rain. Very unexpected. No, it rained today. But hey, even though it's raining in the review, you still have to chuff on. So we'll turn it on, and the on and off switch, if you guys didn't see, it's right here, right there, on and off, so I switched that on. This is to control the crane, the magnet, the loop. So we're going to see if it works now. Oh, way better. Yeah, picking up my screwdriver uh, things. Okay, so yeah, works way better. So that's the battery compartment. Here's a good look at Rocky. Here's how his pistons move. There we go. And here is how his crane arm moves. That's up. That's down. It's swinging around. Here's the controls back here. This side here is supposed to make it go down. So if you point it towards over here, it's supposed to make it go down. Try to get in focus. There we go. It's supposed to make it go down. So yeah, here's a good look at his, at his stabilizers right here. These ends here are supposed to be yellow. The little uh, piece of plastic there is supposed to be yellow. So it didn't do a good job on that. But this here has act pretty good detail. This rocky has pretty good detail. And there's four on each side. You can close them up like this. There's a snap 
in there in place and you're ready to roll. Then I found out is if you, if you close the arm up like that on his truck. So we're going to get this guy ready to for a first run and we're going to have some fun with him. There's Thomas and Rocky on the first run and it's raining now. One thing I want to add on this review before we go is on a negative side this Rocky is not really strong. It cannot lift engines and it cannot lift anything heavy. It can only lift anything light. For example his crate. It can only lift his crate. It can't lift engines or anything heavy like that. But hey a minor thing shouldn't take away from the fact that this is a really good product. Thanks for watching everybody. Don't forget to leave a like, leave a comment and subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps and thanks for watching this review on Trackmaster 2006 Rocky.